Olay Crochet here. I'm coming to you with a how-to video. So I want to show you how to uh, C2C, which is corner to corner. So just any size hook and any kind of yarn um, of your choice. And you would start off with your slip knot and chaining five or six. So I um, am going to do five. So it's one, two, three, four, and five. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna count from the um, other end, one, two, three, and from this third one, I'm going to half double crochet in it. And then I'm gonna half double crochet in the next two chains here. And now that I've uh, finished this part, you have made one block. This little thing here is called um, a block. So we will turn our work like this. And again, we will chain five or six. One, two, three, four, and five. And again, you count one, two, three. And you go into the third chain and make a half double crochet. And then into the next two chains with a half double crochet. And then you're going to take and go right here, which would be those chains that you actually skipped and you do a slip stitch. And then you'd chain one and you'd half double crochet three into the space. So one, two, and three. And now I have created two blocks. So here's my first block down here. And then here are the next two blocks. So I'm gonna increase again by chaining five or six. One, two, three, four, and five. And then again, we count one, two, and three. And then you half double crochet in that third chain and then in the next two chains. And two, there we go. And then you come right here, and right here in the space of the chains that you skipped, you do a slip stitch. Chain one, and then three half double crochets. So one, two, and three. And then again, and the chains that you skipped in the space, slip stitch in there, chain one, then one, two, and three. And see, now you can see I have three blocks. So here's my first one down here, then here are the two second ones, and they have one, two, and three. Now we're gonna increase one more time. So chain five or six. One, two, three, four, and five. And again, one, two, three, we go in the, we have double crochet in the third chain from the hook. And then half double crochet in the next two chains. And then we slip stitch in our chain space and we chain one and then three half double crochets in that space that's one this is two and that's three then again in the chain space slip stitch chain one then three half double crochets in that space and this is three and then our very last one we chain, we slip stitch in this uh, chain space, then chain one, then three half double crochets in that space. So this is two, and this is three. Okay, now we have four blocks. So this is our first block down here. Then we have our two blocks here. They have one, two, and three, and then four. One, two, three, four blocks. So now we're gonna decrease. And the way that I decrease um, is these up here, 
I single crochet in. So I just single crochet one, two, and in those three spaces, there we go, those three um, stitches. And then where I am supposed to put my slip stitch in the chain space, I slip stitch in that chain space, chain one, and then I do my three half double crochets. This is two, and this is three. And then I just continue like normal. And then three, one, two, and three. Then I slip stitch in the chain space, chain one, and one, two, and three. Now when I get to the end here, instead of doing a a slip stitch and chain one you just slip stitch and that's it then you turn your work and you do the exact same thing you did on this end so now I would single crochet in the next three stitches so that's one two and three and then I slip stitch in the chain space chain one and do my three half double crochets so one two and three then again slip stitch in the chain space chain one and then three half double crochets that's two and this is three okay and then here instead of because we've, we've already done this this is our last block here so we're just going to slip stitch we're not going to chain one that's it then we turn and we do the exact same thing we did before. So, single crochet in the next uh, three stitches. Uh-oh. Okay, in the next three stitches. And then we slip stitch in our chain space. Then we chain one. And it's three half double crochets in this space. And this is three. And since we only have one block left, we would simply just slip stitch. And that would be the end. And now you have what looks like a small little triangle, or I'm sorry, a diamond, not a triangle. But that is how you um, C2C or corner to corner. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I actually did the video because um, I am doing a C2C project and i would really like everyone to know how to see to see or corner to corner so thank you for watching